So Smithy, uh, fantastic performance today, fantastic result, a 4-1 win against Lewis. You said at the end of your last interview about the need to get points on the board, this wasn't too bad a way of going about doing that, was it? No, I meant to say, they're, they're a very, very, very good side. Um, there's, you know, there's a reason they were one of the early favourites to, to go and win this league. Um, and they'll still feel like they've got an opportunity to go up. Um, you know, we've just we've turned up tonight. Um, we put a performance in over the course of the the 90 minutes. To be fair, you said after as uh, I'm doing the interview after the Bishops game about how about the frustration about making it too easy for a good side. And yes, they've got to let go late on from a, a penalty, whether it was or not. Um, but we certainly seemed to restrict them at times, and even when they did get through, it was. Maybe not comfortable, but we dealt with the threat. As much yeah, as to. again, they're going to have spells because they are a very good side. Um, said it a long time. Um, you know, there's a reason they were, you know, before COVID, they were close to going up out of this league. Um, probably would have if, if COVID hadn't stopped them. Um, you know, and it's, yeah, they've had a few personnel changes, but they've got top, top players in their, in their dressing room. Um, and they play really good football. You saw second half, you know, it was a case of right. We've we've got four. Um, let's try and shut up shop a little bit. And you know they they did get on top in terms of possession. Um, but we've we've had that this season, haven't we? We've we've absolutely dominated possession and got zero out of it. So you know it's uh, it's it's one of those. It was uh, you know back to the wall job second half. Um, and it was you know again I hate to bring up referees, but. It was like playing against 12 men. It was it, it was just baffling, absolutely baffling. Um, you know the foul that has you know has been given. Um, no one on their team is at, no one has appealed for it. Even the striker has not appealed for it. It's outside the box, and yet it just seemed like it was desperate, absolutely desperate to give them something. And you know four one we should be talking about you know the good play we've had. But again it's. You know, it's, and it's the arrogance afterwards with it. It's it, it, it's really frustrating. Um, but um, what we should be talking about performance. We blew them away in the first half. Absolutely blew them away. We hit the woodwork a few times as well. You know, I said Saturday about giving your forward players, give them the ball and give them you know give them service and they'll produce. And just look what happens when you give them the ball um, because. Bishop thought for you know they're above them at the minute at the table, but they're not necessarily a better side than them at all. Um, you know, and people got to realise that. You know, we'll, we'll see how the table finishes at the end. You know, we're only eight or nine games into it. You know, they're a very very good side, and they will be right up there. Um, so to do that to them, yeah, delighted. The work rate of the players, absolutely superb. Mason, I mean, he's got booked. Got booking in the first couple of minutes for again one of those you don't know what it's for. Um, you know we couldn't risk him at half time with the referee. Same as at Hendon, Chris, uh, Chris uh, Edwards couldn't risk him. <laughs> so yeah, um, it's a shame for Mason because I thought he he set the tone in the first half in that uh, that number ten role set the tone for us. I mean you saw the way that it's been a frustrating period. You know as you said about putting in performances not getting the results and then on the other hand losing games a la Hornchurch for example. Um, but I mean, you could see the way that the players celebrated after they scored their goal and uh, scored their goals and at the final whistle. You could see how much it meant to them to put a to cap off a performance like this and then to yeah, definitely maintain the, 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 the they've win not, as well. They've not been putting bad performances in. They're getting slated by people. You know, yeah, the results haven't come, but I don't know what people expect. Um, you know, people got to slow themselves down a little bit. Um, we're eight. Eight or nine, eight, nine games now into the season, nine, you know, and you got Id, absolute idiots, um, you know, trying to slate us, knock us, abuse us. People got to realise, you know, certainly, you know, they're on me. When I come to the club, they were getting relegated in the league below. Like they, they were fighting relegation in the league below, um, and we were eight games into a league above where there's bigger clubs, bigger budget, bigger. You know, it's not easy. You know, it's not an easy league at all. So. To get the abuse we're getting from certain sections of so-called supporters, I mean, quite frankly, it's a disgrace. It's an absolute disgrace. Um, and we we'll see who posts tonight. We we'll see who, do, you know, it's, you know, it, again, you know, the, the ones that support us and get behind the boys, that's that's for them. But the people that are just, you know, jumping on a bandwagon and want to try and abuse us any decision we make on the sideline, 
again, they're, they're not proper fans. And finally, you know, there's no, uh, there's always a, only a short rest period in, in this league. There's always games coming thick and fast. We've got a long away trip on the Saturday to Bognor Regis Town, a team in and around the mid-table, up mid-table kind of position. Another side that I'm imagining is gunning to, to get at least into the playoffs. I suppose a win like this and a confidence boost like this goes well into a game like that, albeit one that's going to be incredibly tough for us again. No, absolutely. I mean, you know, the biggest confidence boost the players can have is the supporters, you know, fully getting behind them. Um, and the team, that's the biggest confidence boost. Yeah, we won 4 1 today, but, you know, we know our standards, we, we know we want more points on the board than what we got. Um, you know, we had got some good performances which haven't brought results, which has then increased pressure, but, you know, I think people just got to get behind the boys. Um, it's 40 games in this league season, 40 games. We had the same last year when we were outside the playoffs with 10 games to go and it was all doom and gloom and everyone ready to slate people. Everyone was so quick to jump on the negative, so quick. And we made the playoffs and we won the playoffs and you still get abuse. It's, yeah, so the, the players, players need people getting behind them, which you know a lot of our supporters do and thank you to those, you know, and they'll travel on, on Saturday. You know, and that, that's, I say, it's a massive boost because, you know, when things aren't going your way, it's tough. You start, you know, suddenly you, you don't become bad players and bad team overnight. It doesn't happen like that. But it's momentum and, you know, that's a big, big shift in momentum for us. But we know Saturday at Wave Bogno is another tough game. Um, you know, let's not get carried away. It's one game at a time. It's 40 games in a season. We've got to make sure we've got... Uh, Got enough points to be pushing up that table, and that's 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 our aim. Um, it's, our, our aim certainly not to be losing and, and, and being around the bottom area, but it, it may take time, um, you know. And hopefully Saturday we can build on this. Um, but the, you know, the the performances recently, the work rate, you know, work rate can't be faulted. Bishop Stortford here on Saturday, people were slating the work rate. These players are given everything, and if it's not good enough at some times, it's not good enough. But that's more decision making or you know maybe a lack of quality in you know in the right times but the energy and, and work rate that they're putting in Tuesday Thursday Saturday you know I'm not having that being knocked and you saw that tonight